Omar Khadr appeared in person today in an Edmonton courtroom asking for an easement on his bail conditions. Among the asks, unfettered internet access, looser restrictions on travel across Canada, and unsupervised visits with his controversial sister. These conditions are uh, an inconvenience and they're onerous. Omar Khadr has been out on bail pending his appeal on a conviction by a U.S. military court on five war crimes. On Friday, a Canadian court did ease some of his bail conditions, allowing additional internet access. However, Cotter was denied both more freedom to cross-country travel, as well as unsupervised visits with his sister Zainab Cotter. She had previously expressed support for Al-Qaeda, and the court determined today there's no evidence to suggest her views have changed. He does want to be able to contact his sister, and, and he doesn't see how he's going to be able to speak to his nieces and nephews without having uh, some sort of... Uh, uh, supervisor present at the time. So he, he was disappointed by that. Today's application was the latest effort by Cotter to leave his past behind. The former Guantanamo Bay detainee was recently married and plans to move to Red Deer, Alberta to pursue a nursing degree. His lawyer says there's ample support in Cotter's efforts to lead a more normal life. He has a great many uh, friends and uh, neighbors and, uh, and new family members, including his in-laws and, and uh, uh, other support people in, in Edmonton and elsewhere. Among those supporting Cotter is David Rolls, the Edmontonian meeting with Cotter prior to Friday's hearing. I wanted to give him a letter of support. Um, I wanted him to know that uh, I support him and many other Canadians support him. And uh, I think that he has en endured a great deal over the years and I wished him success in his endeavors this morning. This was just the latest application for an easement on bail conditions and Mr. Cotter's lawyers say it's not likely to be the last, especially as they add there's been no movement whatsoever on Cotter's appeal to a U.S. military court. In Edmonton, Courtney Terrio, City News.